You're watching Around Town with Henry Dorman. We're sponsored by Chemung Canal Trust Company. Trust is their middle name. Service is their motto. They're really nice people. We'll see you in the bank. I'll be in the vault. In Hammondsport, there's a wonderful place called the Cinnamon Stick. And if you like shopping, this is a place where you cannot leave without buying many things. And the prices are terrific. And the woman who runs it, who created all of these things, and who is the inspiration behind it, is Terry Spinisi. Penisi. Penisi. And her husband is the dentist next door, in case you want to make a dual visit. Tell me all about this. How did you come up with this? You have um, such nice, warm hands. Oh, thank you, it's Mr. Norman. It's cold out. My, my it hands is cold, cold out today. Here. It well, is we'll, cold we'll out today. We'll hold hands while we talk. But it's nice and sunny in here. It's always sunny in here because you're here. Oh, well, How's thank that, you so huh? much. Huh? <laughs> thank you so much. Tell us all about it. Well, what made you do this? I um, actually, way back in 1983, a friend of mine and I decided that um, we wanted to start a business in Hammondsport. And this other young lady um, has a background in catering and gourmet food services. Mm -hmm. And we thought it would be fun to start a little store. And we actually started over in a different location from where we are now. We were over where the, um, the Cuca Lake uh, Olive Oil Company mm -hmm. is. And we started in that very small space. And um, it, the business became successful. People liked what got, we had. You've got one and a half buildings now. Yes. The top floor of your husband's office. Yes. And you've got all kinds. Of, is this Christmas this on is, the whole floor? Uh, yeah. Not just all Christmas. Part of our second floor is Christmas. Part is fall, Halloween, and Thanksgiving. And part is everyday items And wait till you see well. what they have downstairs. And they have an upside-down Christmas tree behind us. Can you imagine that? That is something. Everybody likes that upside-down tree. Who came up with that idea? Uh, it was just from a company that we purchased things from, and uh, the girls that work for me saw it and liked it and said, can we get it? And I said, sure. And they changed the design of it every year. So every mm. year there's a different theme on that tree. She's so wonderful. you got to come by and see her when you come. But tell us downstairs, you have a lot of things, a lot of local downstairs, things downstairs. Yes, downstairs and we local have things here too. gourmet food. And we also have um, gift items downstairs. We have jewelry. We have um, Melissa and Doug children's products, which are wonderful um, educational and play toys. Uh, we have carried that line probably for three years now, and it's very, very successful for us. And you us. do all the buying and deciding yourself. Well, I, my two employees, that my two full-time <coughs> employees, uh, came with me this year to a big gift show in Atlanta, and they helped me do a lot of the buying. It's, it's very hard to make all the decisions by yourself. But you've got a lot of local products. We do. We like to feature our local products. We have um, salad dressings by Sh Chef Richard Lehrman who I believe started out as a chef at the Snug Harbor mm -hmm. and then moved over to the Village Tavern. And now I believe he's devoting his um, semi-retirement to just working on his salad dressings. And he does a wonderful barbecue sauce and a hot sauce as well. We also carry um, honey from a local um, mm. beekeeper. That's Wixon's Honey over in the Dundee area. Mm. It's a wonderful honey. And again, that changes with the seasons. And we have Cuca Lake Coffee Roasters, which is a very, very good selling item for us. They're a local um, young couple over in the Penyan area mm -hmm. that roast the coffee over there. And they have several different flavors, and they always come up with seasonal flavors. Mm -hmm. This one is um, Cuca Sunset Blend, which is one of their house blends. Well, and they use nice names. Yes, and they use a lot of organic um, mm -hmm. coffee beans. This is one that is What's certified the organic. The jewelry is made by um, a local young woman over in Bath. Her name is Lori Skelly, and she runs a business called Silver Lining Jewelry in mm -hmm. Bath. And she, um, I believe she works for the county, and this is kind of her second business on the side. But she does beautiful um, Cuca Lake necklaces mm. and bracelets. And this one has just the shape of the lake. Is this expensive? No, it isn't. The bracelets sell for 25 The silver necklaces sell for 50 But she also does copper and bronze, which are a little lower in mm -hmm. price. She does earrings. 
Um, she does a beautiful job. She's wonderful. You, and you're not expensive either. I try not to be. <laughs> I try not to be. And then we also have, this is a new line for us. This is a line of wine jellies made by a gentleman over in Penyan. And this one is orange with um, lavender and... Boy, I can't read that. I don't have my glasses. Can you read that word? I guess, guess what? I'm, I've got to take my glasses off. Let me take oh a look. Oh, boy. I think Riesling. Orange, lavender, Riesling? Hip jam. Orange, lavender, Riesling. Riesling. Okay. Yeah. And oh. it's, it's just beautiful. It has pieces of orange peel in it. It's made with the Riesling wine. And then we have another um, company. It's called Kiss by the Sun. And this is out of the Buffalo area. And they do a line of wonderful spices and... Um, seasonings a lot of them are salt free um, all natural products and you know that that's pretty much what we have from our local suppliers but we're always looking for um, you know people in, in the area that have products that would fit in with our our store I think you're wonderful because you have this natural ability to talk to the audience oh I don't know about the camera. That. <laughs> you're chatting with them I try, you know, I, I, I guess I've never been accused of not having enough to say. But <laughs> now, what's the address here? The address here is 26 Mechanic Street on the Village Square in Hammondsport. We're located right next to my husband's dental office, Dr. Panisi. And then right next to him on the corner is the Village Tavern, which is also a wonderful local restaurant. Mm -hmm. I, I feel very strongly about supporting local business. I think that... Um, you know, we're all small businesses, and un unless we support each other, nobody's going to make it. So sure. I, I feel very strongly about supporting the businesses in town and in Bath and Penyon, and, uh, and they the support us in turn. Sure. What's the phone number? The phone number is 607-569-2277. And do you have a website? I have a website. It is. I knew you'd have a website. <laughs> Right now, it's in the process of being redone because it, it is. There are some items on there which we don't have any longer, so mm -hmm. I have someone that's working with me to update the website. But it's um, cinnamonstick.com, in case anybody's interested in looking. But it's it's not really up to date right now. When you come into the store, it's kind of a mind-boggling array of all kinds of wonderful things just from the front entrance right through the first floor, and even more so up here on the second floor. Yes, we have. Um, we try to have a little bit of everything and, you know, to appeal to a wide variety of customers. We have our local customers, of course, who really are the heart of our business. We, um, and then during the summer and fall, we have our tourists that come to the area and uh, the people who may be on the lake for the summer. Mm -hmm. And, you know, we love their business and we love our local business. And that's how we can survive with a combination of the two. And we do stay open right through the winter. We, do. we are open every day, um, winter, spring, summer, and fall. Um, I, I think it's hard to develop a local base of customers if you shut down for part of the year. Mm -hmm. And I know some of the businesses, you know, like some of the restaurants, yeah. you know, can't survive the winter. But we survive it. It's a struggle. But, but we, you know, we try to get through the winter. We offer sales and you know, things to entice people to come in. And, and that's because you're such a nice lady. Oh, well, thank you so and much. She, and she really is a nice lady. Thank you so but much. But when you come by, ask to say hello to her because she can tell you all of these things and she knows where and what are the best bargains, right? I try. I try. We have lots of new things coming in right now for spring. Um, we've got a lot of our new spring merchandise is out. We have, um, oh, we have some new prints, some new... Um, wall art, mm -hmm. uh, home decor. But you've got to come and see it. There's a lot right? to see. There's a lot to see. And our slogan, and one of our customers came up with this many, many years ago, is why go to the mall? We have it all. Why go to the mall? We have it all. We use I that will, in our advertising. I'm going to be here with her because she's an inspiration. She makes me really want to tink. Oh, well, thank you. Thank you. We'll see you here soon. Now, getting rewards is faster than ever. Open a Chemin Canal Trust Company checking account with our debit card, and you can join our You Choose Rewards program. Simply use your debit card to buy groceries, gas, or just pay bills. You could earn 5,000 You Choose Rewards points and a fast $50 when you qualify. 
Open a checking account and watch your points add up fast. For details on how to qualify, visit ShimonCanal.com. Shimon Canal Trust Company, member FDIC. Yeah, it's going down. down. We're about to live it up, y'all. Let's go. It's a big world, and now we're loving this town. It's our turn. So put your hands up, we on the big screen. And everybody's here living out our dreams. Dreams, whoa. never know what's happening in Hammondsport and today we have unusual guests because they're two real estate moguls <laughs> and they are building a hotel right down the pike and it's going to be a best western best western plus best western plus best western you have half of our rooms are suites oh fancy place now you have to introduce yourselves is he the money man or are you the money man or are you joint money man well Slowly, we're both becoming the money man, but it certainly started with Cameron. <laughs> Cameron, introduce yourself. I'm Cameron Dunlap. Cameron Dunlap. Who else has a name like Cameron and a named after a tire? Well, I, I, I only wish that was in my lineage. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, Brian Harris. And these fellows are partners in this hotel, which is going to open on... We're, we're gunning for Memorial Day. Memorial Day in Hammondsport, just, just down the street. And they're going to have how many rooms and suites? 61 rooms, half of which will be suites. And you're going to have a restaurant? We are not going to have a restaurant, and there's a, there's a reason, but there's a couple of reasons for that, if you'll allow me. Sure. One is that collectively, collectively we decided we really didn't want to be in the restaurant business, but the bigger reason <laughs> is because we didn't want to compete with the restaurants like this one in the village of Hammondsport because... They work hard enough as it is to stay in business being you know, a seasonal environment. And the last thing that we wanted to do was pull business away from the restaurants. Instead, what we want to do is push business to the restaurants here in the village, so. Is there a market for sweets? I guess you think there is. We, we are sure there is through a, a, a real detailed um, feasibility study that we did because there are people who come to this area and want to stay more than one night. In fact, we, we expect to have guests stay for a week at a time. During the season, the During the summer, season, yes. it's going to be packed. Well, we hope so. It's already packed now. We packed with, with people hotels. working yeah. and putting up sheetrock and things like that, you're right. No, I mean, the season one is already very successful and popular to the hotels and bed and breakfast. Indeed, there. yes, it, sure, it certainly is, yes. So we're, we're looking forward to... Uh, to a bustling seasonal business. We're aware that you know during the winter we're gonna be slow, but we've, we've budgeted for that. You've been in this business for a while. I've been in the real estate investing business. And you too? Uh, yeah, ever since I graduated college, I got into commercial real estate. I started on the investment brokerage side and then I got into the development sector about seven years ago. I always ask when I meet people like you and people like him, do you sing? No, I don't sing at all. Because Not even in the show. Church a little bit. Well, that's what I mean. He's got a kind of a singing voice, don't you think? I don't know. Stronger <laughs> voice, no? We could try, just, but not on camera. Just, just my opinion. <laughs> yeah. Now, I have to ask one question. Where did you get the money for this? Well, uh, we've gotten a lot of help from the Corning Credit Union, and we need to give them credit. Uh, it, without their uh, financial backing, this project wouldn't be taking place. And they are an amazing outfit to work with from uh, the perspective of a borrower. So. That's um, where our financing has come from. Uh, we also received a, um, a pilot program from the Steuben County IDA, as well as an Empire State Development grant from New York State in the tune of $725,000. So the state and the local um, industrial development agency were both critical uh, for getting this project off the ground as well. And that's certainly worth noting. So all three of those organizations, Corning Credit Union, the IDA, and then the, uh, the CFA grant. Really important, and, and 
the, the exciting thing about it is it shows the state and local government's commitment to tourism and the growth of this area. And what do you do and what does he do in this, this mogul partnership you have? I oversee the partnership of moguls. Yeah, I, I oversee the day to day, all the construction management, um, review every last contract that comes across my desk. Um, You're a lawyer too? No, no. A lot of these don't need a lawyer involved. They just need a good eye, making sure that nothing. But when they do, we bring one right in. You can yeah. count on that. What What is going to make this Best Western? And first of all, why did you choose Best Western? And what is going to make this different than the others or the other area hotels? Well, we actually, we spent a, a, at least a year and a half investigating other hotel um, franchises and the Best Western really lend itself most to the entrepreneurial spirit, which Cameron and I um, are both, I feel, considered. So we had three other hotels that were shortlisted and then after the interview process, reviewing... I like that. And, and what did you call it? The interview process? No, the... Entrepreneurial. Yeah, yeah. process. That sounds majestic yeah. somehow. Not, well, yeah. Best Western lends itself more to entrepreneurs mm -hmm. just by the design of their um, agreement and their structure and then the fact that we're also allowed to brand through their, through their um, rules. We're allowed to brand the hotel on our own. So it's, the, the hotel is going to be called the Best Western Plus the Hammonds Port Hotel. Oh. And other franchise organizations don't allow that kind of latitude. Right, this was the only one that allowed us that latitude. But to get the name the Hammonds Port Hotel, what a great name, and nobody stole it from you before. No. Imagine that. We were yeah. fortunate enough to get <laughs> yeah. it. Yeah. That's a natural, the Hammonds Port Hotel. Stay at the Hammonds Port Hotel. You provide boats too? <laughs> no, no, we're not in the boat business, but next door, you can rent a boat right next door. Yeah. So that's kind of handy. What's the name of the place? Uh, that is uh, Cuca Water Sports. Well, we better do something on them, too. I, I, I suggest it. Don't leave Lance, out the, and, the, Lance and Robin yeah. are great people. And don't leave out the brewery on our other side. Yeah, See, you've got it all set. Yeah. Walking distance to the, to the local brewery. How about that? The, the suite itself, suites and the rooms, <laughs> Is there decor that you supervise, or does it come from the parent, Great Western? Great Park? question. I'm glad you asked it. We decided to, uh, early on, that we wanted to give this hotel a theme, and that theme, we decided, would be of the local... Obviously, the Hammondsport area is rich with history, mm -hmm. and we wanted to bring that history into the building, and we've done that in a couple of ways. One through the, uh, as you refer to, artwork, or in our case, it's going to be all photography. There'll be no artwork. It will be strictly photography, and it's historical Glenn Curtis type stuff, um, aircraft that he, it, you know, created and built, uh, boating history, wine history, racetrack history, and so uh, we have some phenomenal photography that we're going to be um, putting on the, the walls. We have 259 total uh, images, total uh, framed photographs in the hotel with about 90 unique images. Mm -hmm. And the other thing that we've uh, done, and we're very, very grateful to, um, to Mercury Aircraft for this, is um, we are going to hang from, literally from the ceiling in the lobby, which is a two-story lobby, uh, a model of Glenn Curtis's first powered aircraft that Mercury Aircraft, the, the manufacturing and, and fabrication company here in town, has graciously designed and built for us. Um, and so when you walk into the lobby, you're immediately going to see this big, beautiful rendition, a model, a half-scale model of Glenn Curtis's first powered aircraft hanging from the ceiling. You guys are having a lot of fun with this. We are having I mean, a lot of fun. Your eyes glisten when you yeah. talk about these things. Yeah, we're really excited. And I've, you know, I've been a member of this community, either living here full-time or part-time for 15 years, and I, I love this area. I'm an aviation enthusiast. I'm all about airplanes. And to be able to bring that into this hotel and present it to our guests and, and showcase the history that this area you know, has in its um, fabric is really exciting to us. Now, can we come to the opening? Yes, we, we will absolutely invite Memorial you. Memorial Day? 
Well, we're gonna have an open house before that for special guests like you. Yeah, but how about them? They wanna to come too. Well, yes. The main we, we, we wanna invite all of them. We wanna we want to open, uh, we hope to open by Memorial Day. And uh, so stay in touch. You can find us at uh, thehammondsporthotel.com. That's where you'll find updates and information. We're also on Facebook. Um, we have a big following on Facebook. Just uh, go on Facebook and search the Hammondsport Hotel and you'll find us there and we'll, we'll get you updates and let you know all about what's going on. See how good he is? He talks right to the camera just as if he were prof professional. Well, thank, thank you, you very much, much, Mr. Dorman. I appreciate the opportunity. Thank you. You're both professionals. Nice, nice guys and moguls, really nice moguls. <laughs> local moguls, it's important to know mo local moguls. So tune in, we'll let you know when the opening is gonna be, the opening ceremonies are gonna be. And I will be there here. There will be a ribbon cutting, that's for sure. I will be here. I'm going to stay in one of the suites and test it out. <laughs> Great. See you soon. Your Marine Corps' way of life is to defend the American way of life. stand for our nation, for each other, for us all, the few, the proud, the Marines. Now getting rewards is faster than ever. Open a Chemin Canal Trust Company checking account with our debit card and you can join our You Choose Rewards program. Simply use your debit card to buy groceries, gas, or just pay bills. You could earn 5,000 You Choose Rewards points and a fast $50 when you qualify. Open a checking account and watch your points add up fast. For details on how to qualify, visit ShimungCanal.com. Shimung Canal Trust Company, member FDIC. Isn't this a nice position to be in? This is Jennifer Heath, and she's going to introduce the beautiful lady on my other arm and tell us about Huffman Office Supply. Huffman's Office Equipment, and equipment. this is Cindy Collins, our account executive. And she designs all of these for your place if you want your office fixed up. Yes, she's going to fix it up for you, right? For you. Yes. And what and do you do? I am here in the store to help you with many different services. Um, selling paper, pens. This is one of the nicest interviews I've ever done, you know, <laughs> with a gorgeous girl on each arm, and they're so enthused about the business. Tell us what you have, because behind me, I see a lot of things that some of our people here are going to take with us without you knowing it, because they're really beautiful displays and colors and all kinds of office things, but you do more than just sell from here, you sell on the web. We sell on the web, www.huffmans.com. We also have our outside sales, yes. Cindy, who goes to the different businesses. Why did you go away? <laughs> <laughs> well, we're trying to show everything in the store as well. Ah, okay, go but ahead. But you know, it's okay. <laughs> yeah, I actually go out to the offices. If you call me and tell me that you need furniture, I actually will go out to your office, sit down with you, talk with you, listen to what you want, come back, do a design, quite a few of them actually for you, bring it out and let you look at it and tell me which one you like and I will then price it for you and we install free and set it up free for you. So you, know, you don't have to actually come here, you can just call but if you want to come here that's I fine I just too. noticed something interesting. Do you notice how good they are on television? <coughs> they look right at the camera, they don't talk to me, they talk right on the camera and talk to you. Go ahead. I, I don't have a good side view, you yeah. know. <laughs> that's, what, that's all I get because I'm looking at you, you see. So yeah. I don't get a front view at all. Tell us more. We also offer copying services. That's your regular black and white copies as well as your color copies. We do laminating, faxing, scanning, emailing. 
shredding of papers. If you have piles of papers you want to get rid of with uh, vital information that you don't want out there, you can bring it in to us and we'll shred it all up for what you. What is the address here? We are at 7 East Avenue, mm -hmm. Wellsboro. Beautiful Wellsboro. Beautiful Wellsboro. Wellsboro is a wonderful place. Isn't it? It's if gorgeous. If you've never been here, come and shop. They have fantastic bargains. And this place is very nice too. And you're very well priced. Yes, we are. And we what will else try, would you say, right? Well, yes. And we try to match all of your other big stores as mm -hmm. well. If um, you're looking for something and you find it somewhere else, we will try and match that price really? as much as our, we can. And what happens if they come in and mention the station in this show? You'll give them 50 percent off? Well, I can't give 50 percent off. I tried. I tried. I know. I know. It's I, all on sale every I don't day think anyway. Jim Huffman would like <laughs> that very much. But you, you have other locations, too. We do. We have our Montoursville office that is um, another is it, supply is store. For you? And is it, my hands uh, are cold. Yeah. Excuse display? me. My hands are cold. They are. So. Oh, well, <laughs> we'll sit here and warm them up it's for you. It's a terrible you. job. Oh. Terrible Isn't job. It? Terrible. Oh. Yes. Go ahead. And then we also have a warehouse in Pensdale mm -hmm. that has a lot of furniture, which we will be having a furniture yard sale in May mm -hmm. on the Friday, May 13th and Saturday, May 14th. And do they need to phone you to find more information? They can phone us at 1-800-326-9322. That's right. <laughs> You'd be surprised how many people when we ask the phone numbers don't remember their own phone numbers. Well, how often do you call yourself? That's exactly a good point. <laughs> smart, smart, smart. Is there anything else we should know? Website? Well, the website again is www.huffmans.com. Um, you can set up your own account on there. We mm -hmm. do offer business accounts as well as personal accounts. If you have any questions, like you said, you can give us a call at that 1-800-326-9322, or you can call locally at 570-723-8494. So good. And we yeah. do free delivery. It's a one-two punch so. here. <laughs> <laughs> free delivery. Free delivery. What free else? Delivery. What other good things are you going to say? I don't know. <laughs> You're here all the time. You're both here. I am not. I'm, I'm out on, I'm out on the road. You're out fixing yeah. offices for people. Yes. I go out and visit the customers. But you do all kinds of things. You sell these actual file fold files yes. and desks, and you've got some beautiful File furniture. cabinets, chairs, desk units. Everything. System furniture, everything. You're a one-stop mm -hmm. shop. Yes, we are yeah. a one-stop shop. One-stop office shop. You must have the most wonderful time. I do. Because you look like you make people happy all the time. I try. <laughs> I you do too. try. She does. I love <laughs> dealing with job. the customers, and the customers are our, our main priority, mm -hmm. making them happy. Of all the things that you sell, what do you sell most of? Do you see the Sharpie display back here? <laughs> well, you know, I was looking at the Sharpie display. They have Sharpies of every color. These Sharpies. I have already put a couple in my pocket. <laughs> don't, don't tell anybody. The Sharpies, because they it's not just for kids. The adults are more apt to come over here and say, oh my goodness, you have every color. It's so easy to take, too. Uh, well, yeah. No, I mean, to, I didn't mean to steal. <laughs> <laughs> yes, to take them. Oh. And you have every kind. You have the retractable, you have the fine point, the, mm -hmm. the ultra fine points, the chisel points. The chisel point? Yes, the chisel point. I never knew there was a chisel point. That's a chisel point. Oh. Well, I learned something. See that? Yeah. <laughs> and ink cartridges. Yes, we the have ink, ink cartridges. cartridges. We have. You have everything that anybody needs from the office. Anything. Yes, from machines, furniture, and supplies. And if you don't have it, you can get it. Yes. Yes. I knew you'd say that. <laughs> well, you've been very nice. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you. This is the nice part of the job is you get to hold him. My hands are always cold, <laughs> and they're always trying to warm them up. But Thank you very much. That means you got a warm, warm heart. heart. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's a great, great ending for the show. We'll see you here. Come for your office supplies. I will be here holding hands. Ha ha. <laughs>
People think I'm trash, but they're wrong. Today, I'm just an aluminum can, but one day, I could be a stadium. You're watching WENY HD.